Okay, hey Sagittarius, so this is going to be your reading for the month of April. Okay, so we have Heal Your Heart, and we have Trust Your Intuition, we have Get Back Into Balance. Somebody broke your heart here, that's what I'm getting. You didn't trust your intuition in the past, and you ended up getting your heart broken. You could be in regret in regards to this, that's what I'm getting here. What's going on with Sagittarius? Yeah, whoever this person was you were dealing with, they were sneaky here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody was sneaky. This person broke your heart here. Yeah, you could have ended a cycle with this person. What's going on here? Some type of betrayal. Yeah, you're moving forward here as well. So you recovered. Yeah, you recovered after this person like betrayed you here. Could have betrayed you financially here as well. Out of spite. Wow. Yeah, wow. Look here. Somebody also only collaborated with you because they wanted you to feel like you weren't skilled or something like that here. That's not going to be for everyone. Somebody wanted you to feel like you were not skilled. I'm telling you. Yeah. This could be somebody that's like trying to come in with some type of drama, accusing you of not being skilled. For some, this is a family member. What's going on here? Yep, what's going on here? Had you procrastinating in the past. So somebody's coming in to like criticize something that you're doing or criticize your work or whatever this is. What's going on here? Yep, had you feeling blocked? Had you feeling stuck? Had you feeling like you were not skilled here as well. You need to get back in the balance and trust your intuition here. That's what I'm getting. What's going on here? Wow, that's too many. Yeah, this person could be coming in with some type of drama or trying to. Because they see you working hard. Somebody feels like you should not be doing something here as well. What's going on here? Yeah, what's going on here? This person didn't want you to see yourself as a boss here as well. You're very skilled here as well. That's what I'm getting. Yep, somebody wanted you to stop doing something. Somebody didn't want you trusting your intuition. Somebody wanted you to feel like you were not skilled. That's what I'm getting. Somebody wants you to stop doing something. Could have been judging yourself. Could have been up in your head. Feeling like you weren't skilled. That's what I'm getting. Yeah. What's going on here? This could be like a family situation. Maybe you run a business with a family member or something like that here as well. What's going on here? Yep. What's going on here? What's going on here? Wow. It's something significant in regards to like a relationship here. Maybe you started a business with somebody you were in a relationship with. You did not trust your intuition. This person betrayed you financially. Now you're heartbroken and you're guarded. You need to get back into balance. Wow. It is what it is. You cannot change the past. Only thing you can do is move forward and you're going to recover. But you have to heal from what happened here. You were working with somebody that was sneaky. Whoever this individual is, wow. Yeah, this is some type of, this could be a family-owned business or somebody went into business with a lover. You also could have somebody that warned you in regards to this. Somebody that's intuitive. So you have somebody that's intuitive that warned you in regards to this situation. And maybe you didn't take this person's advice. That's what I'm getting here. And you went into business with somebody. Wow, could have been out of animosity because you felt like somebody was like trying to tell you what to do. You felt like somebody was trying to tell you what to do. So you went into business with a third party out of spite. This person calls you a tower moment. Some type of business failed and now you feel guilty or you're upset or you're mad at yourself because you did not trust your intuition. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, wow. What's going on here? Yeah. For some, 
You also feel like you missed out on some type of opportunity here as well. You missed out on some type of opportunity. What's going on here? What's going on here? What's going on here? Yep. Look here. So you thought you were going to be successful with this person, whoever this individual is that you were working with here. That's what I'm getting. But instead, this person calls you a tower moment. Now you feel like you missed out on an opportunity to work with somebody you were supposed to be working with because you went into business with the wrong person. Now you're trying to stay optimistic in regards to a situation here as well. Somebody also was like wanting to work with you because you're in the spotlight here as well. And you get a lot of attention. I'm also getting for some, you have somebody that feels like they missed out on an opportunity to work with you because somebody was so busy judging you, trying to make you feel like you were not skilled, trying to make you feel like you were not welcome or you should stop doing something. And like now that you're successful, this person could be trying to get in your energy or something like that. That's not going to be for everyone. But for some, you have somebody that like, somebody's only one to work with you because you're in the spotlight here and you get a lot of attention. But maybe this person, oh, wow. Somebody's trying to build up a business and collaborate with you because you're in the spotlight and you get a lot of attention here. Maybe this is somebody that didn't believe in you in the past or something like that. Maybe you decided to work alone. You want to work alone, you do something alone. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, wow. What's going on here? This person could be trying to manipulate you. Ooh, we. This person could be upset with you. Somebody could be mad at you because, like, you decided to go your own way. You decided to go your own way and do your own thing. That's what I'm getting here. And somebody is now angry at you because of this. Yep. Yeah. Wow. And this person tried to cause a tower moment for you financially here. So because you decided to go your own way and do your own thing, this person tried to like destroy you financially or something like that here. A plot of roses they fit. For some, this is a family owned business or this could be a business that you own with a friend or something like that. A plot of roses they fit but or a lover but somebody who's wanting to work with you because you're in a spotlight you get a lot of attention maybe a business fell through you decided to go your own way now you're trusting your intuition because you took your power back here and somebody got upset because you decided you didn't want to work with them so somebody could have tried to like oh wow get you fired could have lied on you tried to get you fired or something like that or like to somebody about you to get you fired for some, this is an ex. And for some, this person is just upset seeing that you are successful without them. Maybe you broke up with somebody. Could have broke up with somebody and decided. Wow. For some, this is somebody that did you wrong in the past. You took your power back and moved away from this individual. Whoever this individual is, they're upset because you did this. So this person could be trying to like lie on you. To like, wow, get you fired. Could be trying to lie to your coworker about you here as well to get you fired. Because you took your power back. Somebody could be like trying to ruin your reputation or slander your name here as well. Wow, I'm here to your coworkers. I'm also here to the streets. Somebody wants you to look bad out here or something like that. This person is just saucy because after you stop dealing with them, you leveled up or maybe you are in the spotlight here. You get a lot of attention and you're very successful. And this could be somebody that wanted to collaborate with you because it is. And this person could have tried to cause you a tower moment financially or maybe this person just sees you growing and they want to stop you from growing. Whatever this is, yeah, you moved away from it. What advice do you have here for Sagittarius? Yeah. We have higher level knowledge slash learning. We have removing negative energy attachments keeps you clear and open. Somebody sees you healing and growing and moving forward. And I'm getting this because you took your power back here. 
Yeah, focus more on what you do want. Somebody is watching you manifest here as well. You're happy. Yeah, we have May. What advice do you have here? We have Tuesday. What advice do you have here? Yeah, we have respond, don't react. Somebody could be trying to get a reaction out of you. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody's also judging you or accusing you of not being skilled here as well. But you're growing and learning. So that's all that matters. You just keep moving forward here, Sagittarius. You're glow you're wow, glowing. But you're growing, you're learning, and you're expanding. And somebody could be like trying to like criticize you or accuse you of not being skilled or something like that. Yeah, we have unconditional love. We have be still even when in motion. So it's a lot going on around you, but you are staying focused. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is like straight up trying to get you fired. Somebody wants you out of something. Somebody wants you to stop doing something. For some, you have a lover involved. You can have a lover that's trying to get you fired. This lover could be working with your co-worker to get you fired here. Somebody is upset because you are moving forward. You're successful on your own. You're doing something on your own by yourself. You don't need nobody for clout. You do it by yourself. Somebody else is upset because of that. So somebody's trying to slow something down for you or get you fired or ruin your reputation or slander your name. You know, a pot of roses they fit. But I'm going to end it there, Sag. Best of luck if this is you dealing with this or somebody around you.